damn YouTube. I'm up. Jeez. All right, then. Let's go freaking handle that fasted session. Can I take a shower first? Dang, good morning, guys. Just give me a sec. Yeah, now we fresh, we ready, we ready to go seize the day. And what I always say, if you're gonna seize the day, you might as well see some gains with it. So let's go start with the fasted session. All right, you guys, I'm outside the gym right now, but uh, before I go in, I just wanna show you some of the supplements that I'm taking. I like to start my day with a fat burner first and foremost, just to aid in the shred. And then um, every day we come here and we do fasted work without eating, we put ourselves at risk to like burn our own muscles, you know, because our body has no fuel, so it's gonna attack our muscles for fuel. fuel. And we don't want that. We don't want that catabolic activity going on. So I like to take some amino acids. You know, I, I hear that, uh, prevents that from happening, it preserves your muscles, Drink, eating a lot of protein. Those are things that are gonna help preserve your muscles and help you secure the gains. So we go seize them, but we gotta keep them, so we gotta secure the gains, all right? Cool. So, let's go in there and handle that, all right? Follow your boy. This is a Chucky Beat production. 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 Guys, we done with the fasted session, and you know what that means. It means that we earned ourselves a nice, nice, nice high carb day meal when we get home. I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about, all right? See you guys at the crib. Isn't it amazing? Isn't it absolutely wonderful that five weeks out from my competition and I can still enjoy a healthy, delicious meal like the one you guys just saw me prepare? You know what I mean? Jeez, that bowl of oatmeal, gracious. That cup of strawberries, scrumptious. And those egg whites, elegant yet delicate, delicious. Anything you want to call it, it was great. Nothing short of it. And we're eating healthy here, guys. We're still gonna get shredded after all this. Is eating healthy so bad? You know what I'm saying? Give it a try, man. I can get used to this. I don't know about you, all right? She. so bad man um, that's how I keep it real easy for myself you just prep prep a lot of the food out at once cook all your chicken cook all your vegetables get your rice ready and you just have it in your Tupperware you just grab as you go what I did right there was I put two meals into one so I just combined two meals um, if you guys been watching my stuff you see I'm always doing that because I, I start my day late and I'm always like behind in a sense but um yeah, so I just combine those two meals and um, that's pretty much my pre-workout meal because I'll be hitting the gym after this. So I hope um, 
you know, if you guys get organized like that, I'm sure prep will be a lot easier for you guys too. Cause it wasn't always like this for me. I used to struggle and be just like, uh, you know, scrambling around trying to get everything together. And uh, you know, my time management was really bad. So keeping it simple really helps, you know, just being organized, check it out, try it out. Um, see you guys, let me eat this up. You gotta be ready you guys. You see how things can switch up like that. It can get real hectic real quick. We was just eating some meals a second ago. Now we on the way to go kill some gains, man. You know what I'm saying? The gains is calling. When the gains calling, you gotta come. With that being said, we gotta go kill chess, man. Put it in a grave, right? This is a Chucky Beat production. production. back at the crib guys and uh, for my fourth meal which is what we're on I'm supposed to have two scoops of protein and a cup of fruit but guess what we're gonna try something new we're gonna try something different keep it exciting and fresh we're gonna try to make some protein ice cream you know what I'm saying I got my um this is chocolate peanut butter flavor and I'm gonna put two scoops of this in the blender and I'm gonna attempt to make some protein ice cream, man. Let's see what happens. Protein ice cream. I mean, it's not really, it's kind of icy, but it looks tasty. All right, you guys, so post-workout, we got some freaking protein ice cream. We'll see what's up with that. And then we got some oatmeal, and I'm just gonna have me a whole peach. And I just wanna show you, I got Fifth meal on standby right here. <laughs> you feel me? We got six ounces of chicken, a cup of rice, some green beans, and a positive message. Buggy with the hearts and gains. That's what's up. You secure the gains, guys. You put the gains in your food, okay? Then you're bound to make some gains. All right, for real though, eat up. Eat up after that good gym session. Back outside the freaking gym, guys. I know. I know. Why the heck am I back at the gym? Don't you have a life, bro? No, I forgot to do the um, post-workout cardio, guys. Easy work. Let's get the freak home, man. Get some sleep. Get that last meal in. <sighs> we are back in the room, guys, and I've got meal six with me as promised. Six ounces of ground beef, half cup of rice, half cup of zucchini. Yeah, we're gonna eat that up. Uh your boy's exhausted, I'll keep it real with you, but I wouldn't um I wouldn't have it any other way. You know, we got the day complete. It's always nice to get back home and the day's done. 
Got the fasted session, got a nice workout, and we got our post-workout cardio done, guys. And that's the sixth meal. So we got like all of our checklists in the day. That's one step closer to, uh, you know, hopefully becoming an IFBB pro. So <laughs> hopefully it all pays off, man. And hopefully you guys, you know, hopefully you, get, hope, hopefully you guys are learning something too. You know, taking some value from these videos because my goal is, uh, I've got a goal to like just become the, just maximize my physique, take my physique as far as I can naturally. So that means I've got to train smart, apply the best tips when I'm training, and apply the best tips nutrition wise. And then I'm going to share with you guys. I'm going to share everything that I do. You guys can apply it too. And maybe you don't want to be as big as me or, you know, as buff or whatever, but maybe you want a fraction of what I have. You know what I'm saying? That's what I felt about Kai Green. I was like, I don't want to be as big as Kai Green and, you know, be as muscular as him. But hey, if I apply his tips, he's so wise, and if I apply his bodybuilding tips, then maybe I'll get a fraction of what he has. And I'm cool with that. Let me get a fraction of what he's got. So hopefully you guys can take these tips and apply them yourself and make some freaking gains. But you guys are going to have to let me eat this up and get to sleep. Um, so, yeah, I appreciate you guys watching. As always, you know how it is, man. Much love. Good night, guys. Um, see you guys next time. Hope you guys make some gains. Until then, peace.